What's up you guys, my name is William, I'm from IT Overview as always and in this video I'm going to be showing you the top 3 best video editing softwares for Android. Stay tuned. What's up guys, welcome back to another video. As I said in this video, I'm going to be showing you top 3 best video editing softwares. You can get some sort of the same software from the same brand on your PC if you want to. But remember that this is all my own opinion. Uh, this is what I prefer using if I should choose top three best videoing softwares for Android. But without further ado, let's get started. Number three is called Adobe Premiere Clip. And um, well, I've already made a little project in here. And uh, if I just click on it, you can see what the basic of it is. The way you import something is by pressing on the plus button down here. And then you can choose different things to add. You can take a new picture, you can add some text and whatever you want to. Um, it's really nice. And uh, you can press play right here. And we'll just play the clip. You can choose how long you want it to be. Uh, this is just an image. I don't know what it is, but uh, you can um, go here and you can split it on playhead um, duplicate the clip let's just try that then you get two clips which is exactly the same you can go to one of the clips you can uh, click on this one and uh, uh, get a filter for it let's just try this one it looks pretty nice and then it, you have added the filter you can also add music right over here which is really nice as well so uh, that was the third best out of video editing software in my opinion that now let's continue to number two number two is called power director and um, probably all of you guys who watch this video at least um, a lot of you know this application already it's really smart it is a lot like kind master but uh, this application I think it's a bit uh, sometimes a bit smoother than Kind Master, which I like about it, and also it's much cheaper. It costs about uh, a fourth of what Kind Master Professional version cost, and uh, you can add overlays um, and you can uh, add more media overlays right here. You can add effects to the clips, uh, a lot of cool effects. Well, you can add pretty much what you want, and then there's a lot of settings and. Uh, settings right in here when you can get the, like upgrade to the professional version and you can add overlays like text let's just try adding some uh, text a title right here um, let's just take this one and uh, we'll add it to it and it's really nice a transition when it adds it we'll go to title designer uh, we can uh, resize it a little bit rotate it maybe we can press right here and go to title designer and uh, we will just uh, choose a font, Roboto Bold, it looks pretty nice. Um, make it bold and um, and change the, the color a little bit, looks pretty nice. You can add transitions, which I've done right here. Um, it's pretty much a very good application. Um, so now let's continue to the next one. The next one and the best one. Uh, so KindMask, you probably know KindMask. It's a really nice application and uh, it's probably by far the best uh, video editing software for Android you can get you just make an empty project you can import import some fan art um, I've got made by somebody uh, I just accidentally imported it twice but it doesn't matter I can just delete it very easily and I can uh, do clip effects which is a lot of cool effects in here I can do color filter which is um, as well really really cool and uh, you can do like that um, put like a shadow on it um, you can cut it, you can rotate it, whatever you like. And I got the professional version. It cost me about twenty pounds for the professional version for a year. You can animate it as well. Yeah, and you can add overlays to it. Like I will just add an image, and uh, I'll add. I can place it wherever I want. I can rotate it a little bit if I want to. Then I can make an in animation. Let's just make it pop in um, by the start, and you can see it pops in uh, animated. So like, let's say you want to animate it here. So from here. You want it to be uh, bigger and then you can go here and add a new one and you want it to be smaller and rotate it and move it over here and then you're done you feel like that's pretty good and you can see what it's doing it is making the animation for you and you can add audio of course record your own voice and it's all just perfect in this application and uh, it works really well the only problem is that some devices doesn't uh, support video layers but I definitely hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did make sure to smash the like button down below and and, uh, subscribe for more and if you want more tutorials about those applications then feel free to um, uh, give me some suggestions down below in the comment section remember to share the video as well and I'll see you guys in my next video peace out